Hi guys, what's up? Um, tonight I would like to talk about this hobby boss German Panzerkopfwagen 2 House of J code name uh, VK16.01 uh, Hobby boss is a Chinese player uh, their kits are uh, pretty well and uh, good selected, I think. And not many contenders. For example, this kit. No other producer. As far as I know, maybe uh, one more producer is making this version, but I couldn't remember now. Uh, this kit. You know, uh, Panzer Kampfwagen 2 is uh, widely produced and used in World War II by Germans. Uh, there were many versions A, B, C, D, E, F, uh, J, and uh, the last version is L, Lux. This is a very interesting version. Uh, this has very thick armor. Uh, front armor was 80 mm, side armors were, were 50 mm, and uh, this armor thickness were same with the turret. Uh, armament was same with the other Panzer II versions, 2 cm KWK-38 and uh, submachine gun. Uh, this version of Paz, uh, Panzer II uh, was nicknamed as Small Tiger because it was a very uh, tough tank, little tough tank. I think it was shocked many uh, Russian anti-tank crews. Let's have a look at the box. There is a very good front box art for this kit. small brief about the kit and information about the company made in China. Kit contains a photo edge sheet. Manuals. <clears throat> First, the colored sheets. There is a colored sheet for <clears throat> painting. Uh, this is for Russia. Uh, this vehicle is used only in Russia and only seven of these are assigned to uh, Panzer Division. Uh, mainly green. There are different color codes for Mr. Hobby, Almejo, Model Master, Tami and Humbro. Mainly German grey, steel, wood brown and tie black. There is an advertisement sheet which came out from the box ticket. There are other uh, models of hobby boss. And another hobby boss kit advertisement 3D drawings. Let's go to the build up manual. This manual is black and white. It's made as a booklet. 
as you can see the black and white picture of the box first page has English and Chinese writings and uh, it's showing the symbols using the build up stage this is good first page showing the sprue sprues one two three four five six seven seven sprues a transparent part sprue lower hole upper hole photo edge parts and decal very detailed drawings first page is show starting with the lower hole and suspension parts and tires <coughs> lower hole is made of one part it's not divided into side walls and lower part and I like it this way maybe you prefer the other type but I think it's nonsense to divide this to three different parts uh, this particular Panzer 2 has overlapping tires which are similar to Panther or Tiger and uh, you will have to make many tires. How many tires does it have? Hmm. Six, six for one. Side out. Yeah. Six for one side. Not very much. Tracks are link and link tracks. There are two long parts and two shorter ones and turning parts. It seems good. I will show you. Rear panel has some photo edge parts. It's showing in detail. As you can see, uh, it's showing in very detailed manner for these uh, photo edge. Insulation. It's it's good. Some kids do not show them in detail. One, two, three parts. Three parts are going together here. Come, some plastic parts are coming together on the upper hole. <coughs> Front vision ports are same to the tiger, as you may know. And that's why they are calling it I think a small tiger, you know. But it has two uh, tiger, tigerish vision ports. One for the driver and the other one is for the radio operator, I think. Uh, this diagram is very good, I think. Uh, it's similar to Tamiya ones. It's showing the exact places and exact placement of these parts and uh, exact connection type of small parts uh, as you may see here you have to bend this photo edge part and it's showing it in logical manner this vehicle is a very special uh, vehicle as you uh, can see from the fenders uh, fenders are divided into two parts at each side and there is an escape hatch in between them uh, vehicle has two escape hatches at two sides very unique vehicle very unique 
as you can see here, it's a very crowded page. It's going on <coughs> the vehicles, accessories, and extra links, small photo edge parts. Uh, but there are not many footage parts. You will not be <laughs> abolished under them. Uh, number of parts is good and uh, that's better, I think. I don't like using many, many footage parts. There are over diagrams. It's looking at the area overly and detailed very good drawings at the last page installation of the turret we are using the clear sheet parts here uh, it is a very interesting vision slots uh, here I couldn't find any information about this optional KVK-38 gun barrel. All information I could find is that it's KWK-38 L55. L55 uh, specifies the length of the gun, but there's only one option. But here it's a shorter one and longer one. It states option. What option? I don't know. If you know, please write below the video. There is no many inter details, but maybe this turret is a very small turret. You know, uh, maybe there won't be any more details. Maybe a radio or something like that. There should be a radio or maybe radio bar. In the whole, I don't know. There are mere footage parts in it. And for the last stage, you should add an antenna. Let's have a look at the parts. can see the details for the panel part but um, surface is not textured uh, welding details is here and here there is no injection marks above it and under the there is many there are many injection parts but as you may know after the installation they will not be seen I think it's fine it's easier to make this small vehicle with one part approved good idea And I have mentioned that this has a one part lower hole. Uh, escape hatches. These are made for being closed, but you can open it. These hatches. Mm, there is no surface texture, as I have said before. A little bit oily. Uh, lower hole has some details. I don't know the exact vehicle, but there are some holes. Uh, I think there is enough detail for such a small vehicle. 
no flash at all very crisp and pl plastic quality is very good and I feel good plastic it's like dragons of Tamiya's it's good crisp no flashes at all edges are good it's nice Let's have a look at the tires and other accessories. Um, there is no flush uh, at the sprues, very clean. Uh, I think it's 9 out of 10, very crisp. There is no texture for these parts. I don't know, but there should be some texture for this cast big part, but there is not. Tires are good. Front, front track more is very detailed. It's good. This small part has no flash. Tire center parts. Arms. But you have to cut out of this injection parts. And there's some flashing. I've made some As you can see, injection parts. It needs some cleaning, yeah, but not bad. Pretty fine. <coughs> this is the fenders. As I am opening this kit for this review, sorry, I am making you. We are opening the kits. No. <laughs> These are the fenders. Fenders are divided into two parts. Uh, fenders are very thin. Very good. I think there is no need to use photo etch fenders. They do not seem thick like some kits. And very good. You can see the detail. Spree is very clean, very good parts. That's very good parts. But there are, there are many injection marks under the fenders. One, two, three, four, five, six. They are more than normal, I think. Yeah. But for example, this this antenna. Is very thin, you know, you see. But it's very clean, very, very clean. We will cut this part, and it's okay. There is quality in this kit. Look at the third. Third part is pretty straightforward. It has no many parts. <clears throat> this plastic plastic is very powerful. Like. <laughs> I don't know why they are using this thick plastic for the kids can be thinner and lighter. Turret uh, surface texture is none. There is no any tox 
third surface texture. Uh, but at this, for this small vehicle, I don't know if it's relevant or not, but I don't know at all. Yeah, look at this barrels. There are two barrels, longer one and shorter one. These two barrels are for KWK38. And I don't know which will be used. There is no mention in kit. There is no mention at anywhere. I don't know. This is the submachine gun. It's very good. Very good, in fact. It's very good. I don't know if you can see. Not this injection parts clean, easy sprue. But we need information about this gun. If you know, please write below the video. <coughs> there are small accessory parts. Uh, there's nothing very important there. Hatch, hatches, and small accessories. Let's open this. This is this is two part. This should be this could be better. I think it's not very good. This box surface texture is good, food texture. This is fine. This could be better, I think. Fire extinguisher is very good. Yeah, accessories are good. They are very good. Could be better, but fine. Let's come to the track by track, link by link, <laughs> link by link tracks. To be honest, I don't like these. I don't like link by link tracks, but for these days, even Tamiya is using these for the sake of detailing. And to be honest, they are detailed. Look at these tracks. They are very good. Out of surface, there is no sink marks. Inner surface has, as far as I can see, there is no sink marks for these big parts. Very good. Inner part, inner surface. There's no sync box too. Wow, very good. Small parts. They do not have sync marks too. Yeah, this these tracks are very clean. Very good. Lovely. Ten out of ten. Very good job, Polyros. But it will take time, of course. But you know, this vehicle has an overla overlapping tires, and uh, as you can see from this picture, it has a very good sagging effect. And link by link track will show itself, especially with this parted fenders. 
goes by actually. I think it will be excellent. Let's come to the latest parts. This is a small photo edge. Oh, pardon. This is this is not photo edge. This is decals. Is sealed. This is sealed with that bond. Uh, I don't know why they sealed it. So let me check. There's a very small decal sheet here. And it's stating that it's for long scale. <laughs> I don't know if it's written in wrong or I mean these are correct for this one point twenty five scale, but I think it's written in wrong. I don't know. We are looking at the photo edge sheet. There is clean parts sheet for vision slots. A row for vehicle. There are 24 parts photo edge setting for grills. Some thunder parts. It's it's okay. I think it will give a very good detail to to the kit. Okay. I think this kit is a very good. Uh, it's very very good detailed and uh, I liked it a lot. Uh, I will put into my stash for now, but I will do it in a short time. Thank you for watching. See you.